Hello, this is Bud Frable, Sales and Engineering at Midpoint Bearing and EIS Company. Preventative maintenance is critical to achieving your desired bearing life. It is a common practice to re-grease or add grease to your bearing or equipment. Imagine your job is to grease your company's critical equipment and you walk up to a particular motor to determine what grease to add and two different greases are on the label or data plate. How do you know which grease to use? You can do an internet search for charts on grease compatibility. You'll be happy to find that there are hundreds of options available. Then you can head back out to your expensive piece of equipment and add grease. A short time later, you are having heat issues or a bearing failure. Then the failure analysis points out that the failure was due to mixing of incompatible greases. How can this happen when you verify grease compatibility? Was the chart wrong? The quick answer is no, the chart was not wrong. I reviewed about 25 different charts, all called grease or oil compatibility charts. I noticed that these charts were not evaluating the same components. In most cases, the charts were evaluating the base oil. I do not claim to be a chemist, but I do know that to create an industrial oil or grease, you mix additives to the base oil to create your desired formula. I have always questioned if all the different additives are compatible. The response that I've received is that most of these items are inert, meaning that they won't react. To me, the word most is a red flag. There are only a few items that we can control in the electric motor and pump repair industry, and the mixing of incompatible greases is clearly a controllable item. Although these charts are accurate and from reputable companies, there are too many variables and the results could be catastrophic. My simple solution is to not mix grease or oil and grease compatibility goes away. If you do not know which type of grease is in your equipment, I would suggest consulting the equipment manufacturer or purge and regrease. Thank you for watching. Feel free to reach out to me with your questions or comments. Midpoint Bearing, knowledge through experience.